recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I, I thank my colleague for yielding. On October the 1st of this year, less than one week ago, my brother of the thin blue line, Corporal Michael Paul Middlebrook, a nine-year veteran of the Lafayette Police Department, was killed in the line of duty while responding to a shots fired call at a local convenience store. Corporal Middlebrook is survived by his wife, three daughters, and his parents. During his tenure at the Lafayette Police Department, Corporal Middlebrook accumulated seven letters of commendation for acts of bravery and outstanding police work. Michael understood that his job as a cop began with an oath, and that oath was not to a chief or a sheriff or a marshal. It was an oath of allegiance to the constitutional principles that his badge represents. Corporal Michael Middlebrook recognized unwaveringly the civil constitutional rights of the citizens he had sworn to protect and defend and serve. In March of this year, Michael was awarded the highly prestigious Heart of Law Enforcement Award by the national nonprofit group Beyond the Badge. During the ceremony, Corporal Middlebrook was recognized by Louisiana's governor and presented a commemorative state flag. This award was given to recognize Corporal Middlebrook's ongoing contributions to the low-income community that he patrolled. Michael regularly took donated food items from local convenience stores and distributed the food to the homeless and less fortunate. Michael also collected clothing on his off time and delivered the clothing to poor souls he encountered during his shift. Deep in the night, while the world slept. In the last six months alone, Corporal Michael Middlebrook was recognized for having saved a person's life by placing himself between the victim and the knife-wielding suspect and for single-handedly apprehending an armed robbery suspect seconds after the 911 call was placed. Corporal Middlebrook's chief, my friend and brother, Chief Toby Aguilard, provided this quote. For many in our community, Corporal Middlebrook was the spearhead that brought them to justice. For many others, Corporal Middlebrook was a cradle of compassion. He was an officer's officer. loved and respected by his peers. The void he leaves in our department, in our community, and our hearts will be felt for generations. He will never be forgotten. That quote was from Michael's chief. Brother Michael, you have earned your rest. Your watch has ended. We've got it from here. The thin blue line will never forget your service. We shall always honor your memory, and we shall watch over your family. May our Savior, may our Savior bless your ascension, and may he hold your loved ones close to his own heart. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I thank my colleague for yielding these moments of his time. I yield back.